guys welcome back okay so today's video is a little bit different for me because i really don't do any videos that don't pertain to makeup <laughs> but you know i was so excited when i found out that bath and body works was having their candle sale and i usually miss the candle sale whenever i hear about it it's like oh it's already over or oh everything's sold out so when i actually was able to catch the sale and buy some of their delicious smelling candles to stock up for the year i was really excited so i got this big box in the mail today of all of my candles <laughs> that i ordered and i said you know what i'll go ahead and open them on camera so if anybody is curious about you know how they look or my thoughts on whether or not i like the scents that i bought you know you can just check this video out so i'm gonna go ahead and open up this box and just see what's in here i haven't even opened it or anything haven't peeked nothing okay so i have here my list of candles that i purchased so i can make sure they sent me all my stuffs okay and I have here something that says 50 to 75% off, 20% off coupon. So that's good. I will be keeping that handy. Not that I need any more of that stuff. You guys, I have like a whole shelf of Bath and Body Works, like soaps, lotions, body sprays in my bathroom. So Lord knows I don't need anything like that. Okay, so let's just open this puppy up and see what we got okay so this is the first one this is how it comes packaged if you've never ordered any online before i've always kind of been concerned thinking okay are they gonna break and blah 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 but this is some pretty nice packaging okay so they come packaged like this pretty sturdy cardboard so yeah they like <laughs> gonna make sure these candles don't break okay they too expensive to be trying to replace them. And I think for the sale, I paid $10.50 per candle. Oh, this is pretty. Let me get my glasses. Okay, so this one is Fresh Cut Lilacs. And so this is what it looks like. Very, very pretty. And on the top, it has the, um, well, it says White Barn. So I don't know if that is, I don't want to blind you, but on top it says White Barn. So I guess that is like the collection or something for this candle with White Barn on there. All right. Smells very nice. Smells like lilacs. And I like it. It's nice and soft. It's not anything too harsh. So very nice. I do like that one. It's kind of tricky ordering candles that you've never smelt before online because they might sound like they smell good, but you know, you might get it. And I'm kind of picky with my scents, you know. I don't like anything too, too strong. Ooh, pretty. This says Ballerina Rose. So this is what this one looks like. Ballerina Rose. Oh, that smells really good. It smells just like roses. I know I would like this because I love the smell of roses. Mm, all day, every day. Ooh, this one has a little bit of a different top. It has like texture on the top, which is different because these other ones are nice and smooth. So this one here says Cranberry, Cranberry Woods. Oh, that smells really good. It smells very nice, soft, kind of like, it does kind of smell like you're walking through the woods, quite honestly. It's something that I think I would like to put like in my living room area, just to kind of waft throughout the house. There are certain scents that I like, like for my beauty space, certain ones for my bathroom, certain ones for my living room. So that one, I would definitely put in my living room. But these candles will definitely last me all year. <laughs> and I'm glad because I don't have to buy any candles. Okay, so this one says Flower Shop. 
really pretty purple jar. Oh, that's very soft. I can barely smell it. Yeah, this is very soft. This is something that I would burn here in my beauty space because I don't like anything too strong in my beauty space because it will give me a headache because I sit in here for so long doing makeup and filming and, you know, putting stuff away that I need something that's not extremely strong in here because I have gotten a few headaches from candles while I was sitting in here and I didn't know what was causing my headache but then after I used you know the candle a couple of times I realized it was a candle it was too strong <laughs> oh how pretty okay so this is a holiday one a Christmas one winter candy apple so that's what the jar looks like very cute has a little Christmas decor on there and depending on what this oh look at so cute it has like little, um, what do you call them, ornaments on the top. Very cute. Oh, that smells nice. It doesn't smell like holiday. It just smells like a, like a sweet scent. It smells like sweet candy. And I don't think it smells like apples, but... Yeah, it just smells like a sweet candy scent. This is something that I, I would actually put like in the guest bathroom um, because it is kind of sweet. I don't like sweet smells just wafting throughout the house, but I might would just open this and put it in the guest bathroom and kind of see how I feel about that. It's like Christmas all over again. Oh, how pretty. This says blue ocean waves. This is gorgeous. So, so pretty. Okay. So this one, uh, very nice and peaceful. Very calming scent. Yeah, I would put this like either in my bedroom or in my personal bathroom because it's very calming I can see myself going to sleep to this, even though, you know, you can't sleep with candles burning. <laughs> but yeah, it's definitely a very calming scent. So I do like this. Oh, okay. So this one is Berry Waffle Cone. Very cute. I love the design on there. With it being Waffle Cone, I guess it's kind of like... um what is it kind of like by a pier or something that's what i think of when i see these like palm trees and stuff like you know going down by the pier and getting a waffle cone oh that is strong <laughs> this is strong um yeah it has one of those very strong food smells to it definitely smells like you know, when you get those candles that smell like apple pie and stuff like that. Yeah, so I guess going with the waffle cone, it smells very dessert-like. But for me, it's kind, it kind of has like that sweet and salty smell to it. So it's not nice like the candy apple one. It's just sweet. This one has like a sweet and salty scent to it, if that makes sense. I don't know if you know, you know, how that smells. It's not my favorite. <laughs> it's not my favorite. So I don't know. This one might end up being a gift because that is not my favorite. I typically don't like food smelling candles. So I don't know what I was thinking when I bought that. I think probably the berry part kind of threw me off um, because I can deal with like fruit scents and stuff, but actual food like apple pie and stuff, I don't like it peach pie, peach cobbler, you know. Oh, how pretty. Island Margarita. This one is very pretty. I love how that looks. That is gorgeous. And candles for me are not only, you know, for a nice scent. They're also for decor as well. So the packaging does matter to me. So yeah, this is really, really pretty. Very strong scent of margarita. <laughs> It does. It smells like 
some type of like fruity margarita, which isn't bad. Not bad. Um, yeah, this one might might have to be a kitchen candle because it's definitely a strong scent of, it smells like a margarita. In a good way though. Okay, so this one is white gardenia. And I actually wish I would have bought more than one of these because I actually really, really like the smell of gardenia. So, and especially, you know, the white gardenia scents, they smell really good. My sister used to really, really love gardenia smell. And so it just kind of stuck to me. Mm, yeah, it smells just like white gardenia. So if you like, she used to wear white gardenia perfume. So it smells just like that. If you like work white gardenia scent, you will like this because it smells just like it. Oh, this is nice. This is one that I could put anywhere. Living room, kitchen, beauty space, bedroom. I love this smell. I wish I would have bought another one. Is the sale still going on? <laughs> yeah. So this is pretty, okay. And this is actually the last one, you guys. <laughs> this one is crisp morning air. So it has kind of like this really pretty holographic, like shiny wrapping around the candle. Very pretty. But that's what it looks like. Oh, that smells nice. This reminds me of like the white linen type scent. Yeah, it just smells like clean clothes, clean towels. <laughs> mm, very nice. This is another one that I could put anywhere in the house and it won't bother me. And it won't disrupt my thinking, you know, as far as what's going on in here. <laughs> what is that smell? This is one I could put anywhere and I'll be like, oh, it smells good in here. Yeah, it smells, it has that just white linen cotton smell to it. Very nice. So... That is my whole Bath and Body Works candle haul. And I'm really excited to get all my candles and start burning them and see which ones I actually really like and which ones I don't. But for the most part, there's only one that I'm really feeling like I didn't like. And that is the berry waffle cone one. Yeah. What'd I do with that? Did I already give it away? <laughs> yeah, the berry waffle cone one is the only one that I'm like, mm. I'm not really feeling it. So anyways, that's it, you guys. Thank you for hanging out with me. I know this is a little bit of a different type of video, but you know, it's 2020. We can mix it up some. So thanks so much for watching. Let me know if you guys have any favorite scents from Bath & Body Works and their candles and whatnot, because I might be going back to get another white gardenia. So I might need to add something else to my cart if you guys have some good suggestions. So thanks for watching, and I will see you on my next video. Toodles!